Hello, and welcome to Storytime. I'm Jesse from the Fountain Valley Branch, and today we're going to be reading Starboy, written and illustrated by Jamie Jago. Thanks to Macmillan Publishing for letting us read this. Starboy, inspired by the life and lyrics of David Bowie. From a little room, in a small brick house on a quiet London street, David stared up at the starry sky. Is anyone out there? He whispered. For as long as David could remember, he felt like a stranger on his own planet, as if he'd fallen to Earth from outer space. You can see David right here, wondering. He had mismatched eyes, long, spindly legs made for dancing, and sticky-out ears with a special knack for catching noises no one else seemed to hear. So special that when he listened closely, David could detect a faint cosmic murmur, a chattering of stars. When David heard this star chatter, his entire body would vibrate with far out energy. His eyes would flash, his legs would shimmy shake, and all 10 toes would tip tap. As David danced, he felt connected to the universe and the rhythm of the stars. If only he could share this feeling with someone else. And here you see all of his different personas for those David Bowie fans out there. At school, David could not sit still. He tip-tapped down the halls and shimmy-shaked in class. So that star chatter, that murmur of the stars, gives them some sort of special energy and makes them happy. He added a flash of color wherever he went and let his imagination run wild. But some of the kids didn't feel the same rhythm. They thought David was strange. What planet are you from? They asked laughing. I wish I knew, David thought. He trudged back into class, falling in line with everyone else. So what do you think David's feeling? Yeah, he's sad. That night, alone in his room, David's body began to hum with rhythm again. A spark began to flicker inside him, but he was tired, lonely. So David shut the window, let the spark fade out. He couldn't hear the stars chattering anymore. But something didn't feel right. It was quiet too quiet. Then a hum started, a soft, whispering tone. Suddenly, there was a crackle, a sparkle. What do you see? Yeah, it's coming from the radio. The radio on David's windowsill burst to life. Music flooded David's room. It was extraordinary. With the rhythm of the stars, joy tickled through him in waves. The star chatter would never leave him. It was a part of him. I hear you, he shouted happily. I hear you! David felt like himself again. So what, dropped, what brought David's uh, feeling back? Yeah, the music from the radio. The rhythm rolled through David like electricity. He rushed around the house gathering whatever he could find to keep the music going. An old pot, a pair of spoons, a tin can. He taped a wooden crate and tied string to a broomstick, a broomstick and plucked it. Yes, that was it! By the light of the moon, he rocked to the beat of the stars. So now he's making his own music. 
In the morning, he raced to school. He couldn't wait to share his discovery. Ooh, can you see all the music? Yeah, I see these lines. They're coming from all the music around. Even in daylight, David felt the rhythm of the stars humming inside him. He plucked out the chords, blared the horn, and banged to the beat. His eyes flashed, his toes tip-tapped, and his hips shimmy-shaped. So is he feeling like himself again? Is he having fun? It looks like it to me. As the star chatter hummed loudly, his imagination ran wild. He was a pirate, a duke, an astronaut, and a goblin king. Commotion and color swirled around him, rhythms and riffs, like, <clears throat> like the hearts of stars beating loudly, began to spread. When David opened his eyes, everyone was tip-tapping and shimmy-shaking to the rhythm. The star energy was moving them too. So he, now he has that star energy humming through him and everyone else, thanks to his music. David smiled. The spark inside him radiated like a shining star. In the end. And that was Starboy, inspired by the life and lyrics of David Bowie, written by Jamie Jago. So, this is for all those star boys and girls out there that feel like they don't belong. Hope you enjoyed this story and we'll see you in the next story time. Bye!